it is always important to see references to art history and where these practices evolved, especially for feminist art practices, and also embed them in a theoretical frame to <coughs> analyze current uh, practice. For example, this art film TV project to uh, just to um, rise this issue of feminist art in a democratic way also on the internet because it is hard to find video art. Either you have to purchase them or you have to uh, visit uh, archives in museums or institutions and I think for me the uh, media internet can be a form to liberate this uh, video from its uh, institutional uh, boundaries and to broaden this to a wider audience. Within this remix cinema context I try to deconstruct <coughs> the commodification of women and media images of women within sexualized objects and I visualized this uh, through various um, examples from art history during um, I would say uh, media images from print uh, starting around 1920 until uh, the 1970s where uh, video art emerged and until current pra practices within new media and uh, women artists bound to third wave feminism. Aspects of media now seen in remix practices are stabilizing the tradition of a uh, biased uh, society split into male and female and also they stabilize the tradition of seeing uh, sexualized images of women in media by this objectifying the women's body which is central and also um, these practices are created out of maybe male views and male perspectives <coughs> from also uh, where this media emerged within uh, male structures of media itself. I'm um, also deconstructing uh, the male media internet through artistic projects and practices. For example, I um, developed the project Art Femme TV, which is an um, art and Feminism ITV uh, in the year 2008 and it is, it is running as an ongoing project uh, which is aimed to uh, view uh, women artists' uh, works and their issues within a feminist context um, where this is still developing as an ongoing project and also my own video works for example or photography works.